Hi, Amy Carroll here with a communication snippet for you. I don't know about you, though I can tell that sometimes I'm imagining that once the lockdown is lifted, we can all go back to our lives, you know, business as usual. That, my friends, is some serious denial. The reality is we are forever changed and many people will likely have a challenging road ahead of them. You and I might be some of those people. So I'd like to offer you a rather new age woo woo tool that I've used for several years, which works like magic practically every time I use it. It's called, get this, you ready? Ho'oponopono. And no, I did not make that up. It's a Hawaiian practice of reconciliation and forgiveness, and it translates into English as correction. There's a story that goes with the practice, and I don't know if it's true or not, though here's how the legend goes. There was a doctor who worked at a psychiatric hospital for the criminally mentally insane. His name was Dr. Lem. He would sit with patient files, reading all those horrible things these people had done. And as a way to help him alleviate the pain and the disgust he felt reading the files, he would repeat four phrases. I'm sorry. Please forgive me. Thank you. I love you. Here's the wild part. Every patient at the Hawaiian State Hospital was cured just by repeating those phrases without him ever seeing a single patient. Crazy, right? I'm sorry. Please forgive me. Thank you. I love you. The idea is to do it when you're feeling negative thoughts or maybe you're, you saw something that made you feel bad or mad or angry or fearful or just when watching the news. Or maybe you see people around you misbehaving. Here's an example. I'm in the store and I see a parent and a child and the kid's crying and the parent's yelling and, you know, the typical unpleasant scene. And so I just simply repeat the four phrases. I'm sorry, please forgive me, thank you, I love you. I just do it in my head. I cannot tell you how many times the parent and the child just calm down. Now, this can be used to reduce stress. It can improve our physical and our mental health. It can even heal relationships. Trust me, I've used it on those too. And the reason I share it with you today is frankly, we need all the help we can get to manage the times ahead. As strange as it seems, this is a practice I've found to be incredibly effective and it brings me a lot of peace. I hope it will do the same for you. Good luck and happy partnering.